Alrighty, hey guys, what is up? And um, today, this is actually my second episode of um, Bit Slicer hacking. Uh, you know, like hacking and modding with Bit Slicer for Minecraft. And I don't know, maybe I can do other games, I'm not entirely sure. But yeah, last time we did was we took like four dirt and changed it into like 999,000 or something, I don't even know. But yeah, so now I have a lot of dirt in my inventory. But today, I think what we're gonna do, we're just gonna, I guess, change dirt into. Um, other, um, other blocks and stuff. So here, first what we're gonna do, we're just gonna take all this dirt out, and we're just, all we need is, like, 64 dirt, or whatever. All you need is at least one space open. And so we're gonna open up our bit slicer, and let's open up 64, all right? So, yeah. Hmm. Huh. No, no, no. Come on, come on, it's only 9,000 values. Oh, wow, 60,000. Oh. You can do this, bit slicer. <sighs> okay, good, 140 values. All right, so that's, um, I had a lot of 64 dirt there, and there's a lot of 64 dirt over there. So yeah, that was probably, oh, it's getting nighttime. It's a creeper over there. All right, we gotta do this really quick. Okay, so now we have 64. We have um, 32. So, you know. Like I said earlier, just plug it back in. Right now, all we're gonna do is just try to find the actual dirt variable thing. So actually, you can already see it right there, 64. But just to make it a little more cleaner, we'll just do that. All right, so now, um, I don't know, 999. So yeah, this is what we were up to yesterday, right? We did all this, but oh my God, okay, zombies are coming. So now what we're gonna do <laughs> is we're going to right click this and it's going and show in debugger. Now this is kind of like all the coding for it. And um, yeah, it's pretty awesome. So what we're gonna do is, I actually have this data value chart thing on uh, the Minecraft um, wiki stuff. I'll, I'll give the link for um, the link in the description below. But what we're gonna need is we're gonna need the hex value, not the decimal value, which, which is like the normal value. We're gonna need the hex value. So let's say we wanna change this to um, iron ore, okay? We'll just change it to iron ore. I don't know why we do that. But okay, if iron ore is F, then right here, this is O3. And if O3 was dirt right now, then we're gonna need to change this to OF. So here we go, we have OF. And okay, good. So now we got that. Okay, we have a bunch of iron ore. All right. <laughs> so um, yeah, now that we have that, um, we can pretty much change it to anything only in the blocks though. You see the block type right here? If you start with a block type, then you can change it to other blocks. And I think you can also change it to items. I don't know. No, well, actually, yeah, you can change it to items. But the thing is, you can't change it to to um to uh, to the eggs and stuff. And the only reason is because look, F right here. What was what was F earlier? F was um iron ore. But now it's I of Ender, and um, it's just gonna confuse itself, and it's always gonna give you what's up there because it started out as a block. Now, if you start out with a snowball, it's gonna start with the eggs. Now, we'll, we'll do, I guess we'll do like a whole other um, uh, episode on, I guess, using um, like these. And I guess, I mean, you can change these item IDs, but it's kind of confusing, only because you have the OF right here. Now, let's say you wanna change it to coal. Um, what we're gonna have to do is you're gonna have to take 07, which it, it kind of will be confusing, but okay, actually, I'll do it another time. <laughs> yeah, because you guys are gonna get confused. But um, yeah, so you have it right here. If you wanna change it to anything else, go back to this. And okay, let's say we're gonna change it to um, an end portal. So we'll do uh, 78. 78. And yep, we got that. Go back over here. And now we have a bunch of end portals. And it's the same thing as last time. If you put it in your inventory, then it's all gonna like flip out and just keep doing 64 and stuff. But, um, yeah, I guess that's it, kind of it for this tutorial. I'll put the link for BitSlicer in the description below. I'll also put the link for the, um, for the Minecraft wiki page. 